Let's go over fit to fill. Uh, fit to fill is a neat little uh, editing tool um, used in instances where, say, you have a clip that is you want to you want to fill this whole spot here. So we go from nine seconds to twenty four seconds. Well, let's say your clip's only what like five seconds long. <clears throat> um, this will automatically adjust that clip to fill that whole space there. Uh, it's great if you've got, you know, let's say like a, a walking shot of someone, uh, you know, a, a prisoner going into uh, into court. You only have so much of that uh, walking shot available, but you want to fill that whole space. And instead of putting a time warp down and trying to guess at at, at what speed you have to run it through, this does all that guesswork for you. So um, first I'm going to go over how to, to find that, that button and, and uh, how to place it down here in our toolbar. So I'm just going to hit control 3 and that brings up our command palette. Go to the edit tab and you see right here fit to fill. It's, it's a square with arrows pointing uh, both to the left and the right. I'm just going to click and drag and place that down here. All right, so I'm going to get out of there, and I'm just going to find a clip here. Let's say, I know I've got a, I got this panning shot, and I want to start right when it starts to begin panning and end at the very end of it, okay? But I want it, I want this section from here to here to last this whole period. So I'll put my in and out up top of everything that I want. And then come down here to the sequence and put my in and out on how long I want it to last. Then I just hit the fit to fill. Selecting the bin I want it to put that want it to place the rendered effect into. And it's creating that video effect. Boom. Now it has that time warp on there. And it uh, it's significantly poignant and consequential to firefighters. Um, and you see it slowed it down quite a bit. It lasts, you know, as long as I wanted it to. Fits that space perfectly. Now the, the bad thing is you, you'll have to redo this. You know, if you if you had to adjust something in here, you would have to redo it. But um, great tool to use uh, uh, when you have an exact clip that you want to fit in an exact hole but you aren't sure on the timing of it.